Hey guys, what is up? It's Firefox Beast here. And I promise this is the last one of the serious videos where I just sit down and talk with you guys about the stuff that's going on in YouTube right now. And I decided to make one more video because what I want to say can't exactly fit into a comment section, if it makes any sense. It's There's too much that I wanted to say that I really didn't get to. And YouTube is killing my dreams along with the dreams of every other small youtuber out there it's it's really just upsetting to watch this happen and knowing that you can't do anything about it because you're too small of a channel you don't have a big voice and you just can't do anything it's it's the most upsetting thing to watch the last two videos have really just been me talking to you guys about the changes that YouTube is making and all of that stuff and my opinions on those things. But I never really got to tell you guys how I felt about all of it combined. And so that's what this video is about. This, this is what the part three is about. And to be totally honest with you, I'm more upset than I am angry. Of course I'm angry, but really, honestly, I'm, I'm just upset about about all of this stuff because by doing all of this stuff YouTube has really just crushed a whole bunch of small channels dreams and you know my dreams aren't exactly crushed yet but they're 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 getting there you know and I really just it's it's upsetting to me to watch this happen and knowing that nobody will speak up that actually has a voice to speak up. The only person I've seen even talk about this is Boogie2988, and I give him props for doing that. I also saw a video by PewDiePie telling about this, which is really good. That means that, that big YouTubers are speaking up. That's good, because maybe YouTube will listen to them, but... You know, I really feel like we, us small channels, need to combine. I've said this the last two videos. Us small channels, we need to form an alliance. We need to band together, and then maybe we can make a difference. But that's not the main point of this video. The main point of me making this video is just to address YouTube and all of the dreams that it's crushed by doing this. I just watched a video about a guy who, who had done live streams almost every week for a long time and he would monetize them because people deserve to make money for the things that they create and this guy made a video about how YouTube had just killed his channel and I forget who it was hold on let me let me I'll show you guys let me let me show you guys all right here it is guys the guy's name is libel is here this video that I just watched and he only has 379 subscribers yet 11,000 people watch his videos now you tell me if it's fair that YouTube gets to take away monetization for him but gets to keep monetization for people that have a thousand subscribers but just barely pass the 4,000 watch hour limit. 11,000 people have watched that guy's video and he can't monetize it. That's ridiculous to me. And it's just, it's angering, but more than anything, it's upsetting because YouTube is screwing people over like this guy. It's just ridiculous that they won't listen, that no, they don't care. And you know, I'm, I'm angry about it and you know, but I've already told you, I, I'm just way more upset than I am about it than I am angry. And it's, it's ridiculous. And this video is not meant to promote my channel. It's meant to get my opinion out there. My opinion about everything that YouTube has been doing. And it, in all honesty, in my opinion, it's just completely wrong. People that work hard like that and make videos like that. They deserve to have their videos monetized, and they deserve to get a fair chance at YouTube. And, you know, 11,000 people have watched this guy's video. And it's just ridiculous to me that that's not satisfactory enough to get your video monetized. And what really irritates me about that is that guys like this 
who work hard and make videos every day. Guys, so much more talented than me. They get screwed over because YouTube, because YouTube cares more about its advertisers than it does about its content creators. And the only reason they have advertisers is because they have content creators. So I guess that's really all I had to say for this video. It, it was a short one, I'll, I'll give you that. But I just wanted to express my feelings about this because it's really angering to me. But it's most of all, it's just upsetting, guys, watching this happen to, to the platform that I love and the platform that I, I want to become famous on one day. And it's just, it's it's ridiculous watching this happen. I, I don't know how many times I've said the word ridiculous in this video, but... That's exactly what it is, man. It's it's ridiculous. And there's nothing else that I can do to fix this problem. So you guys, you have to you have to share this video. Don't you know what? I'm sick of saying that. Just tell people about the problems that YouTube is having and have them make their own video if they're a small channel. Have them make their own video talking about this because I'm not trying to promote myself here. I'm trying to get the word out about what YouTube is doing, although I know for a fact that this video probably won't even get noticed by by 50 people. There's probably not even going to get 50 views, but I don't care about that. I care about the 49 people that will watch this video and that will spread the word about this issue, and that will make videos about this problem. Now that's all I really have to say for this video, so I guess that's it. I'll, uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.